amigos, amigas. Still in Tlacapaque, Mexico. Man, what a cool place. I'm telling you. Oh my God. I'm still looking for those hats. I think I gotta go another block or two up. Then I gotta go to Esquera. That means to my left. So then the Casa de Sauna House there. I'm telling you, this is a nice area. Wow. I'm telling you, this is really something. Wow, wouldn't you like to buy that house? It's for sale. This is a cool neighborhood. It's kind of hip. You know, it's, it's good. It's good. We'll see. We'll keep continuing to walk here. And who knows, maybe I won't find it at that half place, but anyway, I'm enjoying the walk. <coughs> Excuse me, because it's, it's, I like it here. Wow, look at this. Look at these sidewalks. Streets are like this all over. This reminds me of Oaxaca City. I haven't seen sidewalks or streets like this in San Miguel de Allende. Not in Central, anyway. Uh, nada. This is Tlacapaque. In Central, Guadalajara has some smooth walkways and streets, too. So, you know. I guess this is just another slice of heaven. But uh, I want you guys to get a look at this city. Man, is it cool. I'm coming back. I think I'm coming. I think I'm going to be able to come back on Saturday. I might. Maybe Sunday. I don't know. You get your oil and stuff here, man. Bandal. Yeah. Okay, let me look around. I just want to keep giving you guys a little bit of this uh, piecemeal, but I'm telling you, it looks like a little slice of heaven to me. I don't know. It looks pretty safe. Looks like it's pretty safe around here. I, I, uh, it's great. You know, it's why people got to step out of their comfort zone. Check out what other cities are like, especially when they're only 32 miles from you. Or 35 miles from you. Okay, I'm going to get off the phone and uh, continue this journey through Guadalajara and Tlacapaque, Mexico.